All right, here's an updated view of the new media rack. It is made from the IKEA Besta line. Custom picked out the individual cabinets and shelf to create the placement I needed. Uh, the middle shelf unit, I left the bottom off to allow for the SB4000 to sit on the ground with isolation feet while screwing the cabinet in the middle to the left and right side. Um, I ended up returning the Panamax 5400 I had. It was defective out of the box. So for the same price, or actually a little bit less, I ended up getting two Panamax MR5100s. Uh, so I could place one on the left, wiring up the Outlaw 5000, the Denon X4200, the Xfinity cable box, the LG 4K Blu-ray player, and the Apple TV 4K. On the right hand side, I was able to add my Xbox 360, my Xbox One, my JVC 200 disc CD changer, and then power up the uh, SB4000 subwoofer. As you can see, I have the SVS Ultra Center along with the Ultra Bookshelf on both sides, sitting on some uh, Santa's uh, Bookshelf speaker stands I purchased through Best Buy. I've been running this setup for what, a little over a month now. I ran the SVS Ultra center bookshelves and ultra surrounds off the Denon X4200 and then I installed the Outlaw 5000 and ran them off that. Uh, they definitely sounded better having the 120 watts per channel clean running to each of the five speakers while running the four SVS elevations off just the Denon AVR. Uh, now that I've played around with this for a little bit, the SB4000 is going to be being boxed up to send back to SVS along with the Ultra Surrounds. The Ultra Center and bookshelves I ended up purchasing locally. Uh, so I'll probably end up either hanging onto those or selling them at a discount to hopefully somebody else locally that would like to try them or possibly in my home theater group and have to do some shipping we'll see uh, i'm going to hook up my definitive technology towers center and bipolar surrounds back up and power them with the uh, Outlaw 5000 next to see how they do in this room. I ran them for about a year and a half, strictly powered off the Denon. So I'll be curious to see how they now sound. Uh, the Definitive Technology definitely fills my room better and fuller when watching movies. And then the SVS Ultra speakers are definitely clearer and more precise. But uh, it's been a, a few months now since I've listened to my definitive technology, and I have to see how they handle the Outlaw 5000 as well. So, um, curious to see how it goes. So, welcome to stay along for the journey ask any questions and we'll see what else I end up doing next might do some different uh, projection screen testing for some different AR ALR materials 
and then possibly upgrade to a 4K projector, or do some 4K projector testing. So we'll see. Uh, thanks for watching. Comment with any questions you have. I'll answer them when I can. And everyone have a great day.